This year is the 100th anniversary of the 19th Amendment, which gave women the right to vote. And that happened on August 18th. And so today I'm joined by a very special guest, Senator Grassley. Thank you so much for joining us. I'm glad to be with you. And I have just recently learned that there was someone very special in your life that was one of the first women to cast a vote. Could you share a little bit about that story? Uh, my mother must have been a trailblazer. She uh, uh, n never talked about this that I remember. I found out after she died. But I look back now and I think maybe a little bit like you. You were the first woman from Iowa to serve in the United States Senate. You were the first combat veteran to be a uh, woman to be elected to the United States Senate. So you're kind of a trailblazer. I look back and my mother did a lot of unique things in her life as a community leader and as a mother and as a teacher. Uh, but uh, never knew anything about what this picture shows about her being one of the first uh, one of the first women to vote in Iowa. And the reason why it would be one of the first is this was the very same day that the Secretary of State of Iowa said because the 19th Amendment passed that women could vote. So about 70 women went to vote in this uh, election for school mergers and my mother is pictured here as one of the four but I didn't find out about this until at least 20 years after she died when a, a friend uh, must have been going through their attic learned it about their grandmother and said you, you need to know about this or did you know about it or something and they gave us this clipping from the newspaper right and which one is your mother Senator Grassley right here okay yeah and one of the first to vote in Iowa and maybe in the nation? Yeah, it could be unless you look up history and on August the 30th where there's some election someplace else in the country where women voted. But uh, this is just hours after the Secretary of State of Iowa said women could vote. So she would be one of the first four women in Iowa to vote. And you said that at that time she was a Black Hawk County resident. Yes, yes. Yeah. yeah, and she was te she taught in one room schools at that particular time. Thanks. Yeah, absolutely. And that was 1920. Yes, 1920. Yeah. Well, thanks. I appreciate you sharing some thoughts about your your mother. But again, it was something she didn't talk about. It was such a significant time in history. Well, we got to thank all those uh, women that worked probably for 60. Let's see, 1920. I would imagine at least 60 years before this action took place, a lot of women lived for this cause and died before it happened. And uh, so we got to thank the women that were trailblazers at that particular time too. Senator Grassley's mother was one of the first in Iowa and maybe the nation then to cast her vote. So very significant, Senator Grassley, and thanks for sharing that about your mom. I'm glad to do it. Thank you very Thank much. You. you bet. Congratulations to all of our women as we celebrate this 100th anniversary of the 19th Amendment, giving women equal suffrage. And congratulations to Senator Ernst carrying on this cause as a leader for being the first woman from Iowa to serve in the Congress of the United States. Thank you, Senator Grassley.